Okay, yeah, your turn. Okay, if I let me see another film for tell. You'd like to have you go home to for dinner and you know um, after work. I would I would actually choose Ripley for aliens. She's very motherly. She's very protective of the people she cares about. She's very strong and she's very you know and, and she knows she doesn't take any bullshit. You know, that's the other thing. She's tough and she's strong. She knows what she needs to do. She gets the job done. Um, you know, as long as I don't get a face hugger on my face, I'm okay. I, I think I've got kind of a checkmate one here. Cool. It would be my number one because she's got, she's all around got all the attributes I think would be for a great femme fatale action adventure and coming home to have dinner with. Mm -hmm. Alice from Resident Evil. It's okay, we're here to help. Now, an elite team has been sent in to stop it. Five hours ago, Red Queen went homicidal. Who's the Red Queen? State-of-the-art artificial intelligence. The corporation's keeping a few secrets down here. Something you're not supposed to see. But they have only three hours left before it begins infecting and mutating the whole human race. Everyone stay calm. What's that? She bit me, man. She took a chunk clean right out of me. You have to get out. Don't listen to anything she says. She's a holographic representation of the Red Queen. She may be our only way out of here. She's pretty tough. But I was kind of referring to the original one, like the first one, you know. She kind of got like weirdly robotic and black tight vinyl outfit towards the end. Yeah, that. But it's, it's cool. It's all good. I mean, it makes sense. It's, it's all good, but the original. And with the asymmetrical cut red dress, kind of yeah. Alice. Yeah. in 400 years for this day. You are needed. We are in the last city on Earth. Some call it the perfect society, but others know better. Government control is total. People disappear as though they never existed. But there are rebels who believe in freedom and who fight in the name of the disappeared. I am one of them. Leon, we have an assignment. The government's protecting something. We want you to eliminate Chairman Goodchild. Do this, and we will have our victory. Ready? Always. Keep off the grass. She's coming. Get to a safe place. Good boys. Our world is beautiful. Worth preserving at any cost. You're pathetic. I'm afraid we're going too far. This is a war. And people on all sides die. You may want to 
duck. I had a life once. Now all I have is a mission. Okay, your turn. I was thinking, perhaps, Furiosa. Because she's kick-ass. Oh, she's got a shaved head like me. You guys didn't have to share any shampoo. You guys have to share shampoo if you go with Ripley 3. The bitch is back. Alien 3. Okay. I mean, you well, know, it sounds what's the benefit of that? Well, she knows how to fix a truck. I don't have to worry about doing my own brakes. She gets stuff done. She wouldn't hit the curb either. No. If she, if she did, she'd blow it up after. Yeah, there would be a large explosion <laughs> behind. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Let's, nice. Let's be honest. I mean, you know. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Warrior of the Wasteland. That's what you need. She, you going for the Warrior of the Wasteland? Okay. I guess so. Um. Okay. I think another femme fatale action mistress I could come home to. I've already taken care of the practicalness with um, Alice. Mm -hmm. I have to go have a little fun and protection inside. Cherry from Planet Terror. With or without the uh, M16 with the grenade launcher. I gotta be with. Hey, this, this, in that's the, all encompassing. In in the in the as as the great poetic geniuses of ZZ Top said, she's got legs and she knows how to use them. Well, she's got leg. <clears throat> and she knows what to do with the other one. <laughs> oh, see, hey, you want stimulating guy talk, here it is. Warm the brain up. I can I concur. You got one more. Oh boy. Honestly, there's a lot. Um, you gotta think practical too. No, I gotta think practical too. Mo you and motherly, which is kind of weird. And I don't I like know, like La Femme Nikita? Which one? I liked the USA TV show that they had. What was that girl's name? I know, but the theme song is playing in my head right now. I know, it was like the TV series. <laughs> They did that for like a long time. Danny Elfman made the, the, the theme song. Yeah, there. it was a pretty cool show. I always found that show interesting. Yeah, you, yeah that was very vague. Give me yeah. one more. That was very vague. All right, well, I'm trying to think here. Yeah. Well, you mentioned most of the classics. Yeah, I know. Um, shit. Well, we are all. I mean, I, I would think I would think another person to go with is maybe like you know. Katniss Everdeen from like the Hunger Games is actually a pretty cool character, her, her action heroine. I don't know. I'm just trying to think here. <laughs> She's an action character, you know. Well, we are always here. This and, uh, is Cherry 2000. We're thinking here. Cherry 2000 was like you know a robot. My name's Andy. And I'm Drew. There is something to be said for artificial intelligence. We're almost there. Japanese are getting there. You have to have intelligence in order for there to be artificial intelligence. And humanity has to have intelligence before that. Well, all right. Artificial processing situations. Whatever. My name's Andy. I'm Drew. Good night. Bye.